Lessons in Internet Marketing Internet marketing can be an exhausting process unless you learn how to handle it. The ones who are novice in this domain have to learn some lessons before starting such a business because it can easily turn into a total failure and disappointment. Lesson number one says not to start a business in a field that is new to you. You can sell anything on the internet starting with grocery and going to luxurious items such as cars and yachts. Only open a business in a domain that you enjoy, it will be an easier job if you do so because this means blending work and pleasure. Adding to the mixture the fact that it is all done from home, what can be more enjoyable than this? Lesson number two teaches us that we should not start this journey thinking that it will reach its destination in a very short period of time, the destination being the profit. Of course, there have been cases in which businesses have become profitable in just a matter of days, but it depends on the amount of work that was done before the official launch of the business. In most cases, it can take even months until you will start to gain something because it is very difficult to create a circle of customers. Internet users who decided to test the services provided by the internet marketing are very fastidious. The offer is so wide that they want the best services in exchange for their money, and in case they are unsatisfied with the services you provide they can easily choose another business because it is just one click away. Lesson number three draws out attention upon the fact that the whole process is a step-by-step -step process. You can't reach your destination if you jump over one or more steps. You might ask yourself which these steps are. Well, the first one is the business idea, the second one is the website design, and the third one is the business advertising. These are the big steps because between them we have other tiny ones as important as the big ones. For example, advertising doesn't mean just to post some links leading to your website, you also need a good keyword to help you in the search engines as well as offline advertising, flyers, radio, and television commercials. Lesson number four says that perseverance should be basic keyword after the business starts running. An online business can't work by itself, even though the amount of work won't be as it is at the beginning, this doesn't mean that you won't have to work at all. Lesson number five, last but not least, says that the offline principle according to which our customer is our master is also available on the internet. You can't see the person, the customer, but you will see his or her money. Taking this into consideration you have to develop a series of special services so that the customer can feel that his opinions really count.